When you're facing a difficult laser measurement problem, you want a solution in which you can have full confidence so you can focus on your application. Ophir Photonics has been at the forefront of laser measurement solutions for over 40 years. One of the challenges that come up in many applications nowadays is measuring laser beams having high power and high power density, and in particular when these beams are also pulsed. High energy density pulses make life very difficult for the absorbers used on the sensors. Short pulses typically require sensors having volume absorbers, and longer pulses present their own challenges. For years, Ophir Photonics has offered a range of thermal sensors using a special absorber type we call the LP1, designed and optimized for just this type of measurement. Now we've made a great solution even better with the new LP2 absorber, now used in some recently released medium and high power sensors. Let's look at four ways in which the LP2 can help you deal with laser measurement difficulties. One, the most basic characteristic of the LP2, the primary reason for which it was developed, is its very high damage threshold the maximum power density and energy density above which a sensor's absorber is at risk of damage. In this example, we see a 1000 watt LP2 sensor specified with a power damage threshold of 10 kilowatts per square centimeter at 1 kilowatt. Note that this value is at the highest power for which the sensor is rated. Remember that damage threshold depends on power level and is lower at higher powers than at low powers. Also note the maximum energy density, in this case 300 joules per square centimeter for 10 millisecond pulse widths. Two, another unique benefit of the LP2 absorber type is its impressive spectral flatness, as you can see here. Since its absorption remains constant at widely differing wavelengths, this means that sensors based on the LP2 can be used for white light or polychromatic beams. 3. The LP2 has a very high level of absorption. As you can see in this graph, as much as 96% is absorbed, depending on wavelength, meaning much less light is scattered back, which for high power beams is an important benefit. 4. The absorption is also largely independent of incident angle, which means it can be used for diverging beams too. Several laser power sensor models based on the LP2 absorber are available for various power levels in the kilowatt and multi-kilowatt range. To learn more, contact Ophir directly or via your local Ophir representative or visit our website.